this unassuming number holds within it the secrets of the universe, the very essence of reality itself. It's a number that's so precise, so finely tuned, that it seems almost like it was crafted by the hand of some divine creator. This constant, denoted by the symbol Alpha, governs the strength of the electromagnetic force that holds atoms together. It's a number that's been measured with incredible precision. A precision that's almost beyond comprehension. But what makes the fine structure constant truly remarkable is the fact that, were it even slightly different, the entire universe as we know it would be completely different. Life as we know it would not exist, and the laws of physics would be fundamentally altered. It's a number that's finely tuned to allow the formation of stars and planets, the emergence of life, and the development of consciousness itself. Was there a creator? Let's look at Genesis. In the beginning God created the heavens and the earth. Letters in the Hebrew alphabet are also used as numbers. The total value of the verse would then be 2701. John also talks about the beginning. In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. Greek letters also are used as numbers. The total of this verse is 3627. Taking both of the numbers from the verses, we will lay them next to each other and then square them. We can also write it out this way. We obtain this very large number. Although cumbersome, we can also write this number like this. Now we will compare this number found by using the two verses to the actual mathematical constant of alpha. Putting the scale aside, the powers of 10, this value differs from the today's known value of alpha by less than 0.0001%. 